We'd like to welcome Ben Cohen from Umbrella Games today. Thanks for dropping in and having a chat with us. Pleasure to be here. Pleasure to be here. Thank you. Um, so Ben, maybe you can start off by telling us a little bit about, about Umbrella. Sure. Umbrella is uh, a mobile developer and publisher focusing on casual games. Uh, so we make some of our own titles uh, and we do quite a bit more publishing with outside developers. Great. So um, since you guys are focused primarily on, on casual type games, um, what sort of ad types are you guys working with and how do you guys figure out what works best? Right, right. Game? So we work across all of them. I don't think we discriminate against any of them. I would say interstitial is still uh, the primary focus because of the, the genre of title. 2017 was the year of Rewarded and I think next year will be even better and better. So mm -hmm. we're definitely hanging there. Do you guys find it challenging um, trying to get the developers to work on you know, ad integrations or SDK integrations? Yeah. Yeah, it can be. Uh, sometimes it's it depends on the developer, but sometimes it's it's challenging uh, to get them. Suppose they, they came to you and they they've been experienced, so they've they've done five games before and they they liked the stack they had in the past. So then mm -hmm. it's tough to get them to understand our point of view or our recommended stack. And and, and and on the other side, there's some developers that are making their first game ever, and and they're just looking for all the advice. And it's very simple. Um, so it's case by case. We like to. Keep things simple for everybody, so that we're, we're not, you know, we have so many titles, and we're releasing about two a month. So, wow. if we start, if we start shifting constantly and have different requirements for different developers, it'll get really complicated to manage. So we try to make right. it streamlined for them and for us. Right. And since you guys are seeing, you know, thousands of titles that probably come across your email and desk on a daily basis That's or a lot, we, yeah. weekly basis, how do you narrow that down and and to you know to de de determine which title you want to work with, which studio you want to work with, like, what's that process like? It starts off by we, we play the game, and if we like the game, uh, we'll want to talk more to the developer. Uh, sometimes we don't like the game, and you know, or there's other issues, like we don't like the platform it's built in, or whatever the case. So once we talk to the developer, we want to make sure that they're open to our feedback in terms of monetization, retention, and then it's just going to be a comfortable working relationship. You guys are, are releasing you know, high volume of games, um, is there a particular you know game that you, or studio that you see out there that's doing something that's like extremely innovative that you're you're kind of excited about? I think the the innovation in my eyes is titles that don't require uh, UA in that traditional fashion. So if you look at like I think Zynga uh, for me is an inspirational uh, publisher. Their focus is on social games. So instead of having to buy tons of users, they buy a couple of users, but those users bring their friends in. Um, right. And I think that's, that's one, it's a really good way to, to make the game more sticky, uh, and two, uh, it's a good way to reduce expenses towards marketing. You can reallocate those resources elsewhere. And what are you looking um, mo most forward to in, in 2018, like from, a, you know, from an advertising perspective? Uh, hopefully rising CPS. But I think for us it's 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 more rewarded um, you know the networks you know if I don't want to hear more in-app purchase and interstitial seems to be declining a bit in terms of eCPM although it's starting to rise this quarter. Well thanks for coming in and sharing your thoughts with us today. It was a pleasure. All right. Thank you.